What's up everybody, in this tutorial I'm going to talk to you guys about how to make arpeggiated um, chords actually chords by using the silent arpeggiator um, I found this cool trick out not too, actually a while ago when I first started producing um, and I've been using it ever since um, if you've seen in the projects um, I usually just draw out like uh, I'll just draw out notes kind of like for pads and then from that on I can make chords so in this project I have this simple um, just a simple chord going and I'll show you how it sounds without it And this is how it is with the arpeggiator. Um, so it's basically like uh, progressive chords like Dead Mouse, Cascade, Adam K, and all the other ones. Um, but progressive house. Um, but this is how it's done. I'm gonna delete this real quick. So what you wanna do is open up Silent. And it's actually a bank. It's called the Adam Van Baker. It's in the presets too. Adam Van Baker Soundset Part Two. And you'll see this pluck, actually chord called Mouse uh, Mouse One. And all it is is just basically a pluck with uh, arpeggiated to be a chord. You have this one as well. So that's uh, basically it. It's called the Adam Van Baker um, Sound Sound Banks preset number two. Um, it's just a cool trick. It's not really nothing really too specific. But what you can do as well as you can copy the arpeggiator. Just like if you don't like these sounds, you can copy it, and then you can go on. Um, for example, let's try house chords <laughs> but yeah you can also copy it and then open up a new bank and just paste it in. I'll show you that. Just a little bank. I really like this bank right here. Presets number two. Ugh. Right here. Mm, I'm gonna pick the euphoric pluck. Um, so that's it. I um, hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to subscribe, check our channel out, our Facebook, our website, and um, I'm going to be trying to upload more tutorials. I know um, I haven't been uploading much, but it's just I don't have much time. But I'll be trying my best, and uh, um, see you guys next time. We'll stay in touch.